Smart Marks and Bio. Tell your moms to get your showers running because y'all stink. Now look, wait a minute, war's coming. Get your eyes wet. To witness the first two casualties of that war. Get your mom ready to look at this in your dumb face in that front row purple shirt. And get your mouths ready to hail the new king and queen of bar wrestling. time here at Bar Wrestling. And like we said before, we are the premier promotion for tag team wrestling, and that includes mixed tag teams. Cloudy, you are absolutely right. The Bomb Bays are ready to take on the king and queen self-proclaimed of Bar Wrestling. Yeah, well, you know what? I mean, I can't, you cannot deny that Taya Valkyrie is the queen of bar wrestling, hands down. She's been on just about every single show we've had. Definitely she's a staple. Almost, a nine, I'm gonna say 90, per, I'm not a statistician, but I'm gonna say about 90% of the time she comes out on top. Definitely a huge, huge contender in singles competition here at bar. And her and John recently yeah actually had a, a fantastic intergender match, tag team match against uh, Alicia and Eddie Edwards, where they came out on top. Maybe they we'll did. see a repeat. Well, oh, Jake Atlas John and taking Taya. the legs out from under Taya Valkyrie. They are, they are legally wed. Definitely Love. a chemistry that's different. Love is eternal. And uh, that makes John the king, the king, the king of our wrestling. Oh, Taya with cover. Jake sweeping the leg home for a cover of his own. Backing up Taya, who I think is, is just stunned and taken aback by the speed and agility of Jake Atlas. And now, aside from just being king and queen of bar wrestling, John is actually the mayor of Slamtown, which makes Taya the first lady of Slamtown. And Prince Presley, who accompanied them to ringside earlier, the first dog of Slamtown. Now, does that make Rick Knox the comptroller of Slam Town? I think that would be exquisite. And I believe, though, that they're going to see these Bombays as just the peons of Slam Town, the Slamtonians, maybe. And they're probably going to be subject to some slams. Heather Monroe facing off against John Morrison. Yes, he he's had a lot of nicknames. I believe tonight he's going by Johnny Barr. <laughs> She's a, Heather Monroe is here to shine tonight, to glisten like the sparkly gems on John Hennigan's, Morrison's, Mundo's amazing pants. Cracking a strike to the skull of Heather Monroe. Heather Monroe, who recently became Hurricane Pro Women's Champion last, uh, last month, John looking oh. for an elbow drop, trying to play it cool as Heather he, he meant to snuck do that. out, releasing a snap kick to the midsection, cracking some ribs in the meat, sweeping through and, and going back to town on the rib cage of Johnny Barr. You know, I talked about Jungle Boy and how much he's improved. The same goes to Heather Monroe. In the last year as a singles competitor, she's really broken out. Heather Monroe, an absolute firecracker. Like a powder keg of energy ready to she's explode. just got She's got star written all over her. Oh! oh! Beautiful. 
successful takedown to the mat from Heather Monroe. She's proven herself in singles competition and tag team competition is, is definitely where she excels. Ooh. Heather dragged by the hair hard by Johnny Barr. Johnny Barr, does that mean he's picking up the tab? I mean, for the Bar Wrestling Faithful, I, I would hope so. I would hope not for his sake. Because that would. He can do it. He's the mayor of Slamtown. I know, I know, but wow. That's, but that, now. That adds up. Some intensity exchanged between the two competitors in the ring Jake Atlas, Johnny Barr. Jake Atlas is athleticism a and. A, what a couple oh. of athletes. What a couple of, of, of elite athletes. Absolutely. Oh. Kick to the mush of Johnny Barr. Jake Atlas winding up. Oh. Caught up by the speed that can actually match and rival that of Jake Atlas. I can't believe what I'm watching here. Oh! Another huge strike. Cracking. Like thunder. Johnny Barr, absolutely incredible. Johnny Barr, is as, as he ages, he increases his agility. He's like a fine wine. He innovates more of his maneuvers, and he moves faster and more incredible than ever before. Johnny Barr, absolutely deadly, but now disrespect being shown by Jake Atlas to Johnny Barr's wife, and Heather takes a huge kick to the jaw for her troubles. Now it's a two on one. And that's where the experience comes in. And it, you may not like it, but this is the kind of t strategy that wins matches, and no one would know better than these two. Taya Valkyrie tagged in. Spend a couple years down in Mexico. I'll teach you a thing or two. I mean, absolutely. A two-time AAA Rena de Rena champion. I mean, beautiful show of affection. Love is eternal. I'm hoping it doesn't distract during this matchup, it, and it seems to have only fueled their offense. Taya goes for the cover, hooks the leg, two, and Jake Atlas makes his way out. Heather Monroe, she was ready though. Ready if she had to break up that pinfall for her partner. Oh, I think she's ready, all right. She doesn't, she doesn't come to town if she's not ready. Heather Monroe, born ready. But Jake Atlas now taking the brunt of a chop, but tossing Taya into the corner and delivering a chop of his own. Oh, now Taya just firing away at Jake Atlas, who is just not loopy. Checking for blood, checking for missing Taya teeth. Attacking with a viciousness. Just a vicious, mean streak. She kind of reminds me of Luna Vachon tonight. Taya Valkyrie is someone that will win by any means necessary. She'll pull out all the stops. She'll beat down her opponents and absolutely batter them to ensure her victory. Oh! And they are definitely working well as a team here, as well as any team that we have. They're working as well as a PP Ray. They're, they're like Los Luchas in there, these two. They're a natural tandem. A natural tandem. Maybe team. they're the people's pair. Maybe they are the people's pair. I mean, they're self-proclaimed king and queen of bar wrestling. But now, Johnny Barr well, that wouldn't that headlock. Make, that wouldn't make them of the people. That would make them royalty. That would make them they're royalty above. That would make them above the, the way above the people. Oh, but Jake Atlas, cat like agility, lands on his feet, searching for Heather Monroe, who gets knocked out at ringside again. By Johnny Barr. Smart move by Johnny Mundo, keeping this down, keeping, keeping it a two on one, but Jake Atlas. With that Death Valley driver, flattening Johnny Barter. Jake able to create some space now. Oh, now Jake looking for the LGP DDT. Hooks it, oh! Mundo holds on to the top rope. What Very a, smart maneuver. What a tough break for Jake Atlas. He needed that opening right there to make the tag. Jake Atlas eating some mat for his efforts, unable to make his way over to Heather Monroe to take over in this matchup. Just measuring those shots as he tags his partner. Jake definitely in some dangerous territory. Slamtown population Jake Atlas. 
And oh, Taya just standing, putting all of her body weight on Jake Atlas. Suffocating him right over there, but now in the center of the ring. And another shot oh, from Heather Monroe. Trying to just take Heather Heather's Monroe taken, out of the equation. Heather's taken most of her punishment. Two. Two count. Heather's taken most of her punishment standing on the outside. And I thought it was dangerous on the inside. Taya Valkyrie, the Impact Knockout Champion, firing away at Jake Atlas. Another kick. Right between the shoulder blades, clipping the wings, so to speak. Heather Monroe absolutely fired. The aggression, the tension is palpable oh, as now Johnny Barf just shooting off strike after strike at Jake Atlas. Jake's just taking a tremendous amount of punishment at this point. He's easy pickings right now for the royal duo of bar wrestling. Jake Atlas looking dazed and confused. I don't even know if he escaped the clutches of the First Lady and Mayor of Slamtown. Would he know they're where not a Duke. Monroe even is? They're not a Duke, they're not a Duchess, they're not even a prince and a princess. They are the king and the queen. The king and the queen. Now Jake Atlas, another finding himself back into the corner once more. Oh, able to get a kick up. Posting himself up. Holy Spanish fly from Johnny Barr. But Jake, oh my God. Has he done damage to himself at the same time? Yeah, it looked like he drove himself head first. Sheesh. Looked like he drove himself head first on that Spanish fly. But now both competitors laid out on their backs, trying to make their way to their tag team partners, searching for that corner. Right now, it's just a race against time. Who can make the tag here? Heather Monroe chomping at the bit, trying to get that tag. Tag made, Heather Monroe in action. As Taya Valkyrie gets a oh, big cross the body way across. from the Killer Bay. Halfway across the ring, Heather Monroe with that cross body. Heather Monroe, I believe the last time these two met in singles competition, Heather Monroe did not come out victorious, and she's trying to change that. Oh, but takes a big shot to the midsection from Johnny Barr. Even, even someone as talented as Heather Monroe can overcome a two-on-one. Heather Monroe gets the boot up in time, though. And with big head scissors, take down to Johnny Barr. And that sends Johnny to the outside, but now oh. half and half. Half and half on the Buena Loca. Hooks the leg One, here. Two. Gosh, no. Buena Loca basically crumbled in half at the clutches of Heather Monroe. No, the, mat the matriarch of bar wrestling kicks out. And the scepter stands tall. But Heather Monroe, a fierce competitor nonetheless, putting her heart, her soul, her everything. Yes, but can she usurp the throne? Can she collect the crown jewels? Oh, not at this rate, Loudon, not at this rate. But Heather Monroe, I'm hoping to see that she's got some fight left in her. As Buena Loca, Taya Valkyrie goes to the cover, hooks the leg, and Jake Atlas breaks up the pin. Jake has oh. taken so much punishment tonight. An amazing show of guts by this young man. This incredible athlete, this future superstar. Johnny Barr checking on his wife, his tag team partner, his partner in life. Emotions running high in this matchup as they face off with the Bomb Bays. We mentioned being a tag team is much like a marriage. Well, we have that quite literally here in the ring. The Bomb Bays forged in the fires of the Santino Brothers Dojo. Santino tough through and through. And now, Clobberfest ensues. Huge strike off. Jake Atlas ducking. The big wow. step up at Zagiri. <laughs> the king of bar wrestling just got kicked by the bartender. Well, if you're playing the bar wrestling drinking game, take a shot. Oh, Taya catching. Oh, and delivering. Care of Taya Valkyrie, a big boot. Johnny Barr. That's a little payback. Oh. Double connecting. 
as the crowd erupts here in the Bootleg Theater. We've got pandemonium here right now, right here in downtown Los Angeles. The main event competitors strewn across the ring here at Bar Wrestling. Our crowd here using that energy to try and add some vigor to that, our competitors. That energy is contagious. It's electric in here tonight for this main event. Oh, talk about electricity. Heather Monroe firing back with some big dynamic strikes on the ropes. There we are, bitch better have my money. Heather with fire in her eyes, but oh! Beautiful Northern Lights oh! into a double stomp. Hot damn. Taya Valkyrie showing no mercy. Jake rolls through and slams. Taya face first to the mat. Oh, your waist lock from Onus. Oh, wow, big suplex from Jake Atlas. Oh, clock with the forearm to the, oh. Johnny Barr sweeps through, brutal attacks. Holy hell. Johnny Barr looks like he's gonna, he's about to lift the keg, nice and high. Oh, Jake Atlas, this is definitely not where he wants to be. Oh, oh. as he's flattened at the hands of the King of Bar Wrestling. We've seen quite some innovative offense here tonight. You never know what you're gonna get in bar wrestling. And now Heather Monroe attacking with all of her might. Trying to wrench the air flow of Johnny Barr, but taken down hard by Ty Valkyrie. Ty perching up Heather. Delivering to Johnny, Johnny Barr once more. And the cover, one, two, Jake breaks it up! The Bombays are still alive as Jake Atlas breaks up the pinfall. There's still fight left in Jake Atlas, incredibly enough. Oh. Into oh. Heather Monroe's knees. And the Bombays go for the double cover. One, two, and Johnny Barr breaks it this up. This time Johnny breaks it up. Neither team willing to submit to the other. This certainly is a barroom brawl right here. You're right, Loudon. This is descending to not even be a match, but an absolute brawl in this ring. Heather yeah. Monroe I trying Rick, to. Rick Knox has lost control here at this point. Uh, Heather whipped into the corner. Taya following close behind. Johnny Barr delivering a huge Superman punch. Cleaning the clock of Heather Monroe. Taya with the double knees. Jake Atlas though. Trying to steady himself on the ropes. Searching for his footing. Oh! Caught him. Caught him right Johnny before. Barr looking for Starship Payne. Taken out of the equation. And that would have been it. Oh! Big destroyer from Heather Monroe. Jake but now Atlas. take off the top rope. Oh! And the Bombays go for the cover. One, two, three. Big win for the Bombays here tonight. And here are your winners, the Bombays. Kathy, what a big win for Bar Wrestling's own Bombays. Everyone in here tonight is so proud of them. What a huge win. I guess the king and queen have been dethroned. An absolutely stunning victory for the Bombays, showing themselves as a force to be reckoned with here in bar wrestling. Well, thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you for all.
all our viewers on the High Spots Network for Loud and Noxious and Kathy Campanelli signing off here at Bar Wrestling. Until next time, the bar is closed. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen.